Hello, white gentleman here. Sometimes it happens that sunset photos aren't as warm as we would like them to be, or there is no or very little of this very nice sunset glow just around the sun. There is easy trick uh, how to make this sunset glow more pronounced to make images warmer, and I will show you how to achieve this in Photoshop. Start by opening your image in Photoshop, I have already done this. Uh, next go to layer, new layer and give it a name of sunset glow and click on the OK button. With your new sunset glow layer selected, make sure to add new layer mask to it by clicking on this very button and layer mask. Okay, we have layer mask added. Next, select gradient tool. Make sure radial gradient is selected and also make sure that white is used for foreground color and black is used for background color. Okay, now start dragging your gradient starting from the sun down. Okay, I will drag gradient right now. Okay, uh, you don't see any effect because there is nothing in, uh, in your layer, in Sunset Glow layer. So to view uh, your gradient, Alt click on the layer mask. This area uh, is the area where effect will be visible and the black area is where the effect won't affect your image. This area is further from the sun and we don't want to make everything warm in our image because it would look too too warm to to orange. Okay? Now next step is to select your background layer again, select I dropper tool and sample area somewhere around the sun. Basically we want some golden or orange uh, tones. You see, I have orange uh, selected as foreground layer, uh, as foreground color. Next go back to your sunset glow layer, but this time uh, select your layer, not layer mask. Select paint bucket tool and click somewhere in your image. Uh, by clicking you fill the layer with orange, it's, it's completely orange, but note how the layer mask uh, limits the, the scope of the effect to just the area around the sun. Uh, next uh, go to blending modes and change blending mode of your sunset glow layer to overlay or soft light. Uh, now drag the opacity down to around 20 to 40 percent. It depends on the image. I will drag it, okay, to 24. Uh, and let's compare how it looked before. The image is definitely much warmer, but uh, the effect is too strong in the clouds and in the sky in general. And maybe these walls here shouldn't be affected as well. So select brush tool, change uh, foreground color to black by clicking on the X button. Select smaller brush, maybe not that small. Okay. And also make sure you have selected layer mask now. Now what we will do is to, to paint with uh, with our brush over uh, layer mask to limit the effect even further. Also make sure that you have a uh, small flow selected to make your uh, changes more more feathered. Okay, and now simply paint with, with your brush over the areas you don't want to affect. I will restore color original color of the clouds here and of this guy, okay. I will drag okay to 23. And we're done. It is how it looks now and it is how it looked before. The image is definitely much warmer now. It has nice, pleasant, uh, warm color in this area as well as here. Basically, uh, in this ca in case of this image, there was already some glow, but uh, but by using this simple effect, the image became even warmer, even more pleasant than it originally was. 
Thank you for watching and until next time.